right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K23. Got a jump shot for y'all, man. I know what y'all thinking. Jay, 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 these jumps in season four, the jump shots is crazy. The variations are crazy. Can you please come out here and save us from ourselves? Bro, I got y'all, man. I know 2K be doing stuff. I know what they do. I know how they how they try to finesse us and finesse the system. But you can't finesse a finesse. So if you don't do nothing else, make sure you like the video and comment finesse down below. I might be a little early on that one. This is gonna do two things for y'all. Number one, if we can average 8K views per video, we're going to be giving away a next-gen console. It might be early because, uh, yeah. Uh, we're going to be giving away a next-gen console, 500 bucks, or a laptop, or, um, you know, just whatever y'all want, man, out of that thing. Uh, also, every single Friday, we give away $50 in VC cash out, or we give away a copy of a video game of your choice. Last but not least, the bots are down there trying to tell y'all that I'm trying to give away some stuff, man. Look, bro, don't listen to the bots. Only thing you need to be doing is know I'm on Instagram, Twitter, and the Tiki Taki. I'm not putting my phone number down there, and I'm not on um, Telegram. So make sure y'all ignore those. And with all that out of the way, good morning out there, 2K land, man. Listen, I know I'm a day late and a dollar short, but I'm here to save y'all's week, man. Here to save everything that y'all got going on, man. This jump shot is an oldie but a goodie, but I made a variation because the last jump shot I put out, you couldn't get it if you, uh, well, I'm gonna show y'all in one second what it took to be, I knew I was too far for that one. Uh, what it took to be able to get it and why we did what we did on it right here. And why does that feel like it's too far? It, it said, well, I don't, I don't know if it said early or late, but I know that ain't too far. It's crazy because in the game, I can, I make those with no problem. Maybe it's because I got catch and shoot on and stuff like that. But uh, out here, it's just like some stuff like I can make it from over there, but over here I couldn't make it. But in the game, oh yeah, I, I guess it's because it could be because of hot spot. Am I late on that one? I feel like I was late. Yeah. So the last ones, did they say early? I don't know what they were saying, man. Y'all know that this is my weakest spot on the court. Y'all let me know what y'all weakest spot on the court is. But there we go. That's gas. But uh, yeah, that's my weakest spot on the court. But like I said, this jump shot right here, bro, is gonna take y'all to the next level. And like I said, that's my, that's formerly my weakest spot on the court. But let me show y'all the jump shot, and I'm going to show y'all why it's important, the change that I made. So the other day, we made, we found, we found a, first things first, you got to do this one, jump shot, early timing is where I am. I feel like if you are a set shooter, a catching shooter, you probably want to do early instead of very early, because I'm going to explain in a video later today why everything is like it is. Um, but, uh, so look, why, if, why I do that, why I say early instead of very early, because you can't tell the difference between those catches and stuff. But listen, so this is the old jump shot right here. We used to do OG Ananobi for the base, Sadiq Bay, Shea Gilles Alexander. But this one is for, to get the same tail and for it to look the same, it, it's not going to be the same. And if you move it down here towards Sadiq Bay, right, you couldn't do nothing, but you had to go almost to to like what 90 some percent to get it 97 percent to get it to be an 80 so look what we did this week uh earlier we discovered uh tomas sanaroski right as a as a jump shot the jump shot literally is the exact same everything is the same except for with sadiq bay look check it out you go Tomas Sanaraski, uh, it's Tomas Sanaraski, uh, OG Ananobi the base, Tomas Sanaraski, and then uh, Saturan Sataransky, my bad, and then uh, Shea Gigi Alexander, 66% towards Shea. But look, Sadiq Bay, right, we do this, the only thing that changes is you get some height. You get some extra height on the jump shot, right? But you don't, I mean, and you're not gonna notice that between a B and a B plus, but everything else literally stays the same, but you have to have an 81 three ball to get it right so so you can't you can't you could you wouldn't have been able to use it put the Tomas Sanaraski on you're gonna lose a little bit of your height but I don't I mean I don't think the height is important anyway and if you go that way I mean you know they want you to that that's the faster jump shot anyway you know his his is what makes it fast or whatever if you go down there 66 toward him you're gonna I mean it looks good but it's a little faster and then you lose some height so boom you can use the Shea Gilles Alexander, 66%, bam. And then you can use this with an 80, but everything else is the same. The most important stuff is you're not jumping that high. You're not jumping that high. 
and then you also are not um you're not jumping that high and you also are not uh, you don't have to have an 81 you can just have an 80 and use it with the shade and it's literally the exact same jump shot uh as far as visually the cue time and everything these are the badges that i'm using right here so y'all know that i had to I, I i did some stuff um as far as my badge work uh i wanted to i wanted to change it around and i'm working i'm rocking the double defensive core right now I, I don't have bro i can't core nothing over here i don't finish at the basket y'all know i don't finish at the basket but i'm rocking the double defensive core so i lost the shooting core but um this is what i'm using catch and shoot on silver corner specialist on uh actually this is how i'm gonna change i'm gonna do it like this i'm gonna go catch and shoot on gold and then i'm gonna use uh corner specialist on silver because i mean i don't think i really use that i think the catch and shoot and claymore are the two most important ones and then we got limitless range i lost my guard up but that just mean i gotta take shots and the way they letting you shoot right now bro you really are just gonna shoot right you shooting through people right now like uh see it was saying the other day he's like it's just insane the way that people are shooting through people playmaker y'all see what i got floor general needle threader got uh vice grip cord quick first step i don't think i can get quick first step on nothing else and then we got bailout you know what i'm rocking on that defense this is what i'm rocking ankle breakers uh brick wall uh off ball piss uh you know pick dodge i got that all the way up i'm just testing that out on hall of fame i probably need to bring that down but you know it is what it is workhorse for what i'm not never rocking that again because it doesn't help me y'all let me know if, it, if and maybe i was just using it wrong so i could do that but if we was in the park and you know you're gonna run into a lot of iso i would probably do this something like that but this is a shooting video so this is what i'm using listen if you got extra bad just put it on clutch shooter put clutch shooter at least on bronze end of the games if you've been bricking it up all game you're gonna shoot better and uh you know put green machine on but you really don't need green machine because you got to green everything anyway so if it's gonna help you green yeah but uh volume shooter is also a good badge man but like i said the reason that this jump shot is gonna help y'all out a little bit more is just because you can use it with a true 80 with a true 80 um with a true, and you saw I was a half thing there, and I, I knew this. I knew this was gonna be slow, so I adjusted for it. You can use this with a true 80 uh, three ball, and you don't have to worry about it. And like I said, it's when it's up over his head, and uh, you can actually take your time a little bit more with this one because when it's when it when he puts it to the front of his head, right? That's when that's the earliest part of the green window. But just notice you got a little extra time. I tried to hold it a little extra time there, but you know, I probably shouldn't have. But you you, you might gonna think that you're shooting it late. You got a little extra time to let that thing go, man. But look, like I said, y'all see how I've been shooting uh, the last couple of days. I scored like 65 points with this joint, man. So, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure y'all like and comment below. And I'm gonna holler at y'all next time, man. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Champ. Guys, please. Guys, please.